Hi, how are you guys doing? I just wanted to give you a little bit of a rundown on some of the Josie Moran products that I have tried and um, a couple that I've really loved. So I started out, um, somebody gave me some of the argan oil. This is the 100% um, pure argan oil. It's organic and it's a moisturizing oil um, as a birthday gift. And I have since purchased it again. I absolutely love this. It goes on really nicely. Um, you know, I usually use it at night. I might even put it on top of my um, serums and other moisturizers just as an added layer of moisture because I have really dry skin. So, it, you know, it does have a bit of a shine to it, but it absorbs. I mean, it really, I mean, you probably could just use this under your makeup if you used it sparingly. And they say you can also use it on your hair and body and all that too, but um, I generally use it on my face and then I rub the extra onto my hands. Then they also have a light version now. It's ultra lightweight moisturizing oil, also 100% pure. And um, I bought this because I wanted to be able to wear something during the day when I wanted that extra hydration. And I've liked this very much too. Um, I'll put this on my other hand uh, so you can see. And it has this really nice dropper, so you're never really wasting it. Just make sure you always screw the top on right away so you don't knock it over. I've done that before with a different serum. So I don't know if you can tell much of a difference, but um, it, it, it feels a little lighter going on too. Um, and you know, looking at my hand, it's a little bit less shiny. So um, that's generally the one that I've been wearing if I put it under my makeup. Um, then I also got their little uh, coconut watercolor cheek gelée, and I have Poppy Paradise. And this is really nice. It's very sheer. Um, let me just try to put some on here. I'm trying to put kind of a lot. Um, but it's a very light, pretty color. And I will usually use this and then put another uh, blush on top of it. Um, but even by itself, if you just want a, a little touch hint of color, this has been very nice. So I, I would definitely recommend this. So those are the things I absolutely love. Um, then I've also now tried their, uh, it's called Instant Self-Adjusting uh, Foundation. And this is in light medium. And so it's the one... I'm not that big a fan of this because I like more coverage to start with, but so it comes out and it comes out kind of white. And then when you rub it in, it has like little grains apparently that explode. And then those are what kind of, I guess, match your color as, you know, foundation here. Uh, and it's fine. It's just a little too sheer for me. And the little grains, you have to get used to that feeling because they go away. I mean, they just, but that's just part of putting it on. So I usually will wear this like if I'm not really doing a lot of makeup because I'm just going to be, I don't know, I'm going to be running around and then I'm going to work out or I just throw something on Saturday morning because I'm cleaning the house up or something like that. You know, I'll do that. And it comes with, well, or you can buy separately to go with it. Um, that, uh, one second here, just got stuff all over it from my hands, um, a powder. And this is the Argan Matchmaker Powder Foundation. And I also got, of course, light medium to match. And, uh, you know, it has a uh, little sponge and it's kind of, you know, got the flip up to the powder. And I really like this powder a lot. I use this powder a lot of times when I'm not even using that foundation. But when you layer this on top, it does give you more coverage. Um, so that works too. I just, for some reason, just like my uh, regular foundation I use on a daily basis um, a bit more. So, um, you know, again, I'm not saying that it's not great, it's just not my favorite thing out of foundation land. But I'm a huge, huge fan of the oils, the cheek gelée. Oh my God, and they have the best, you know what? I just lost the lid to it and I'm, I'm at the very bottom. I really have to toss it now. They have the best lip balm. It is so cute. It looks like a little castle on top or something. It has just the cutest packaging and it feels nice. It has a really wonderful scent. I have um, just purchased the clear one, but I think they also have it with some color to it. I got it the first time uh, Sephora had a 500 point bonus and it had a, a mini of the argan oil, the uh, lip balm, and I forgot what else. There's something else in there too. I think it might've been a makeup remover, oil makeup remover or something. Um, but anyhow, so I got hooked on that and I, I purchased that again when I ran out because I like it so much. It really moisturizes and stays on. So overall, I give all the Josie Moran stuff a total thumbs up. Yay. And um, you'll just have to try the foundation and see how you like if it works for you. So thank you so much for watching. If you're enjoying these videos, please give it a thumbs up below and uh, subscribe if you'd like. That way you can see what's coming next. And I hope you have a wonderful evening or day wherever you are.